honey pie. Come away in and see who's at home today. Granny Murray's house has one at home to play. Granny Murray's house is home too. <laughs> who's here today? Well, I've got precious. But don't just sit there, Poppet. Come on, let's get busy. <laughs> Well, what do you think this is? A tractor. Yes, but today's really special because it's Lisa's birthday. <gasps> so we're going to make her a birthday card. Yes. Is that a good idea? Yeah. Oh, what do you think? I'm so excited. And stick and you put some nice blobs. I've got precious, but someone's missing from home today. Not anymore. Who's coming home to Granny Murray? Oh, it's Lisa! Yes, with Tina! Hello there! <laughs> Tina! <laughs> and Lisa, come on, we through Honey Pie! <laughs> <laughs> oh, the birthday girl's here! <laughs> Happy birthday! <laughs> uh, Granny Murray, um, do you know what Lisa's favourite nursery rhyme is? Well, she always asks me to sing Old King Cole. <laughs> oh, why don't you all dress Claude up as Old King Cole? Oh, shh, Granny Murray. It's meant to be a surprise. Oh, well, we're going to have a secret chat to the chairs. <laughs> so What's the surprise? Well, I'm going to ask the Ferry Boat Band to make a special recording of Old King Cole on a CD as a birthday present for Lisa. That's a fantastic idea. <laughs> Who's going to sing the words? Dr Juno. Oh, great. Oh, by the way, here's your invitation to Lisa's birthday party. Oh, thank you. Oh, I'm afraid I'll be working most of the day. I think I'll probably miss the party. I really wanted Lisa to have a special birthday. Oh, it will be special, Tina. We'll have jelly and cake and we'll put up decorations. <laughs> After all, with a bit of thought, you can make everyday things look really special. Can you? Well, <laughs> I hope so. Oh, look at Claude. Oh, <laughs> oh hello, Your Majesty. <laughs> oh, Your Royal Highness. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'd best be off to work. Give us a hug, Lise. Oh, have a happy party, birthday girl. <laughs> Come on, then. Bye. <laughs> and remember, you can make everyday things look special. Thank you, Granny Murray. I'll see you later. Bye-bye, darling. We'll be thinking of you. Me too. <laughs> now, will you keep a wee eye on Tina? Make sure she gets the right way to work. I'm on my way to work today Walking my shoes through the city views Stepping along, I'm swinging my arms Singing my way through the city's charm Getting there is just so fine I so enjoy my walking time I always know the way I go But can you? Show me the way I go. Hey! Okay, which way? Do I go that way or do I go this? Which way's a hit and which way's a miss? Left! Okay, left to the garage. I'm on my way to work today. Looking this way and that way. Hello, builders. Oh, hello, hat. Okay, down. You showed me the way to go. Thank you, you showed me the way I know. Thanks for helping me get to work. Okay, right now it's time to get changed for work. All dressed, 
dressed and ready to go. Hi, Tina. Oh, hello, Mickey John. Do you want to lift in my taxi? Not today, but what I do need is a prop to do with dancing. I'm teaching all the children in my class about the history of dance today. Have a look round our box of stage props. You might find something there to help you. Thanks. A metronome. Hear that? Tick, 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 tick. It sets a beat to dance to. I think the children of my class will love this. Can I borrow it? Of course. Thanks. See you later. Bye, Mickey John. Nine o'clock. I bet Granny Murray's just dropping Lisa off at nursery. I love to skip in Riversy Bingo, Riversy Bingo by the sea. I love to skip in Riversy Bingo, Riversy Bingo, that's for me. Bye-bye, Lisa. I'll see you soon, Angel. Oh, good girl. Bye-bye. I wish I could be a fly in the wall to see Lisa at nursery. All your recording equipment. Yep, we're looking forward to singing Old King Cole, aren't we, Chuck? Oh, yes, ready to rattle my crown and bobo. <laughs> you both look fantastic. Say cheese. Cheese! Brilliant. Now, I'll leave you to set up and I'm off to work. Bye. Bye. City roads are waiting Ooh. The traffic lights are changing Police cars are cruising The trucks keep on trapping And the city roads are waiting for me To take a drive in my pretty pink taxi People wave me down in my pretty pink taxi Get into the back and just relax for the She's going for a drive. Look in the mirror, shift that gear. Pull up to the busy lane, my pretty pink taxi takes the strain. Oh, the radio calls up a taxi fare. Who am I going to meet? Looking for a job in my pretty pink taxi, oh. In a city, my pretty pink taxi, yeah. Drive, drive, drive in my pretty pink taxi. Ride, 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 hey, where you wanna go? Cause I need to take a drive in my pretty pink taxi. People wave me down and relax for the ride. so busy, but, ah, oh, you're all set up. Ready to rock and roll, Tina. All we need now is... Dr. Dr. Juno! Hi, everyone. Oh, hello, Dr. Juno. Oh, listen, thanks for coming along to sing old King Cole for Lisa. Wow, this is the business. <laughs> Here, take my crown to get you into the vibe, babe. <laughs> OK, let's hit it. A one, two, three, four. Oh, King Cole was a merry old soul and a merry old soul was he. He called for his pipe and he called for his ball and he called for his fiddle as three. Every fiddler had a fiddle fine and a very fine fiddle had he. Twiddle dum twiddle dee when the fiddle as three. Twiddle dum twiddle dee twiddle dum twiddle dee twiddle dum twiddle dee when the fiddle as three. Twiddle dum dum twiddle diddle dee. Ah, oh, perfect. Thanks, Tina. There you go. Oh, is that the recording? Yep, take good care of it. I will, don't worry. I'll just nip home, burn it onto CD, ready to give to Lisa. See you later. Bye! <laughs> <laughs>
Oh, Lisa is going to love her song. I love to skip in River Sea Pingle, River Sea Pingle, that's for me. Oh, Ruby, my voice! Ruby, my voice! Oh, you chicken fixes! You chicken fixes! Give me a big break! I think. Oh, Lisa, you and Mum will be home soon, and I'm sure she'll want to join in the fun, won't she? I love you, Mummy. Hi, Tina. Oh. Sorry it's taking so long. My computer crashed, and I needed to fix it before I could make Lisa's CD. Oh, thank you, Dr. Juno. Lisa will be thrilled. Well, here it is. Sorry I didn't get the time to make a case for it. Bye. Well, thanks, Dr. Juno. That's not a very special present, is it? I mean, I've tried to get to Lisa's party. I I've tried to get Dr Juno to make her a great CD. And I've tried to make her present really brilliant. But nothing's gone right. What went wrong? Where did the time go? At eight o'clock, I dropped off Lisa at Granny Murray's. Lisa got a digger birthday card. And the children dressed up Claude like old King Cole. Granny Murray gave me an invitation to Lisa's party. She promised to make it really special because I was going to miss most of it. At nine o'clock, I got to the garage under the arches and changed for work. Mickey John called by. He wanted to borrow one of our stage props to teach his class about dancing. At 11 o'clock, the ferry boat band arrived to set up the recording equipment because I had asked him to record a special CD of Lisa's favorite nursery rhyme, Old King Cole. At three o'clock, I got back to the garage. Dr Juno arrived to help with the singing. She sang Old King Cole as the ferry boat band played. It sounded fantastic. Then Dr Juno went home to burn the song onto a CD. At four o'clock, Dr Juno came back with Lisa's CD. Her computer had given her trouble and she hadn't managed to make a cover for the CD. So Lisa's present doesn't look at all exciting. Now remember, you can make everyday things look special. Make everyday things really special? Well, of course. There are lots of everyday things in the garage. And I can use the photos I took to make Lisa's CD really special and make my taxi look really special too. Well, Lisa will love it. It's a race against time. I've got to do it, I've got to do it I've got to beat the clock before the chime I've got to sort it, I've got to sort it I've got to do the job on time Like a busy bee, I'm going to beat that bong I'm going to finish this job before I finish this song Do we think she's going to do it? Do the job that needs to be done? Will she know how to fix it? Will she finish what she has begun? Yes, I'm sure she will get there in the end Because she knows what she should do I'm going to beat the clock before the chime I'm going to sort it I'm going to do the job on time Like a busy bee, I'm going to beat that bong I'm going to finish this job before I finish this song Do you like my disco taxi? <laughs> Me too And the photos of Dr Juno and the ferry boat band make a brilliant cover for Lisa's CD <laughs> Well, I think it's time that old King Cole went to the party I can't wait to see Lisa's face when I get there. I'm coming, Lisa. <laughs> oh, so it is clever, Gero. Hello, Tina. <laughs> oh, happy birthday, Lisa. <laughs> <laughs> well, you look at this. It's a disco taxi. All aboard. Oh, come on, Lisa. <laughs> look at that. Uh -huh. A disco ball. Oh, clever, Gero. Let's play your new CD, Lisa. Oh, King Cole was a merry old soul, and a merry old soul was he. He called for his pipe, and he called for his ball, and he called for his fiddle three. Every fiddler had a fiddle fine, and a very fine fiddle had he. 
Twiddle dum twiddle dee when the fiddlers three. Twiddle dum twiddle dee, twiddle dum twiddle dee. Twiddle dum twiddle dee when the fiddlers three. Twiddle dum dum twiddle diddle dee. Let's go! Let's go crazy! Look who's here, Lisa. <laughs> Hello, Lisa. <laughs> Hello. Will you say thanks to Granny Murray? Oh, I've been squeezing, <laughs> I do. <laughs> oh, and thanks from me too, Granny Murray. I remembered what you said. You can make everyday things really special. <laughs> oh, is that so? <laughs> Come on, you'll want to be home. <laughs> bye bye, my darlings. Looking forward to next time. Oh, me too. <laughs> And I suppose you want me to tell you all about my time too. Well, there was waving, greeting, hello, meeting, dancing, dusting, shearing, choosing, eating, sleeping, fetching, sketching, painting, stretching, gluing, chewing, sticking up and wiping round, picking up and sitting down. <sighs> but what was really special about today? Well, Claude was dressed as Old King Cole because it was Lisa's birthday today and Old King Cole was her favourite nursery rhyme. We dropped Lisa off at nursery. She must have had a wonderful time as everyone sang Happy Birthday! After nursery, it was time for Lisa's birthday party. We had jelly and cake and played games. Lisa had a fantastic surprise. Tina had made her taxi into a disco taxi. We drove around the city as we listened to Lisa's new CD. She loved it. Do you like going to birthday parties? <laughs> Me too. Bye bye, honey pie. Me too. Hello, honey pie. Come away in and see who's at home today. Granny Murray's house has two at home to play. Granny Murray's house is home too. Who's here today? Well, we've got Gary and we'll get Molly. But don't just sit there, let's get busy, Pickles. Because you help Granny Murray with the babies, don't you? That's a good girl. Oh, tuck them in nice and warm. Molly, you come and give the baby a wee bottle. <laughs> Sit down, that's a girl. Well, we've got Gary and we've got Molly. But someone's missing from home today. Oh, not anymore. Who's coming home to Granny Murray? Oh, it's Lisa with Raymond. Hello there. Raymond. Hiya, Granny Murray. <laughs> oh, and Lisa. <laughs> In we come. Well, Lisa is really looking forward to going to the picnic at Castle Garden today, Granny Murray. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you dress Claude up as a statue in the park? <laughs> yeah. Oh, the statues are great. They're so grand. <laughs> mm, I think I prefer to be a statue sitting down. <laughs> Come on, then. What's this? What kind of statue are you, Raymond? Yes. Julius Caesar riding his horse. Well done. What a simple. I'm going to... Uh, true. <laughs> We've a lot to do before we go on our picnic, Raymond. But I'll get everyone to help. After all, many hands make light work. Absolutely. <laughs> oh, will you look at Claude? <laughs> He's a perfect statue. <laughs> Oh, Claude, how do you manage to stand so still? Here you are. Uh, oh, thanks, Lise. <laughs> Claude, you are a real star. Oh, bye, Lise. Well, I better get to work. Come on, then, let's get you going. Now, remember, many hands make light work. Thanks, Granny Murray. You guys have a fun day. We'll be thinking of you, darling. Me too. Now, will you keep a wee eye on Raymond? Make sure he gets the right way to work. I'm on my way to work today Walking my shoes through the 
city views Stepping along, I'm swinging my arms Singing my way through the city's charms Getting there is just so fine I so enjoy my walking time I always know the way I go But can you show me the way I go? Hey! OK, which way? Do I go left now? Or do I go right? Which way is wrong now? Which way is right? Left! OK, left to the station I'm on my way to work today Looking this way and that away Hello, taxi. Hello, tank. Hello, trolley. Hello, plank. Hello, lorry. Hello, bank. He's on his way to work today. Looking this way and that away. Hey! Do I go up now or do I go down? Which way's a smile now? Which way's a frown? Up! Up! Told me the way I go. Thank you. You showed me the way I know. Phew. Here we are. So what next? Ah yes. I have to get changed into my smart uniform. All dressed and ready to go. Once more onto the buffy car, dear friends. <laughs> Hi, Mickey John. Ah, Raymond. So why aren't you in school? I'm taking my class on a history walk along the Roman Wall in Ravechester. Oh, great. It was an amazing wall, you know. It's very old and crumbly now. The people used to live along the wall in Roman times. They built it so long ago, from the bottom up, stone by stone. Oh, I hope they don't all fall. Well, of course not. The wall lasted for years. And as I say, the ruins are still there today. Amazing. Isn't it? History is just so exciting. So what can I get you? Oh, I'll have a pineapple. Oh. <laughs> That'll be a pound, please. OK, Raymond, I must just go and sit with the kids. Oh, I wonder how my kid is doing. Mm. I love to skip in River Sitting, go River Sitting, go dance for me. What have we forgotten? Apples. Apples, hope. That's a good girl, thank you. Apple juice. Apple juice, Molly. Many hands make light work. Oh. And what else do we need? Eggles cake. Of course we do. Oh, we can't forget these. They're your dad's favourite, aren't they? <laughs> Are you having fun, Daddy? <laughs> They suit you. Oh, Bobby, it's you. What can I get you? Um, a bottle of water, please. Oh, yeah. I'm here to meet Mickey John and the children to help on their Roman walk. Oh, they're just at the other end of the carriage. Yeah, I can see. Actually, I'm a little bit worried about keeping the children amused on the walk. You're full of good ideas. What would you do? Hmm, well, Roman wall, Roman soldiers. Oh, well, they marched along the wall. So instead of walking along the wall with the children, you march. Get in line, soldier, and follow me. Drum, 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 drum. Roman soldiers on the wall. Keep marching, soldier, while I serve this customer. Can I help you, sir? A banana, please. Anything else? How am I doing, Roman general? Head high, knees high. Anything else? That's 50 pence, please. Hail Caesar. Ooh. Soldier, halt. Fantastic! <laughs> I can't wait to go and tell Mickey John. <laughs> no, forward march with my work. I love my train. I'm so happy being me, doing all the things I love to do. Lemonade or tea I'm just very happy serving you Oh, I talk, talk, talk all day Making special moments on my way I'll tell a joke and toast some cheese on toast 
Oh, walk, walk, walk all day, bringing smiles and happiness my way. Being nice is what I love the most. Six is set the looking fine. So happy being me, meeting all the people on the train. Can I help you clear your things? If there is a problem, I'll explain. Oh, I talk, talk, talk all day, wheeling trolleys, weaving to the sweet. I'll do a trick and make the journey quick. Oh, I walk, walk, walk each way, loving all the things I do each day. Bringing smiles and happiness my way I love my train Ooh. What can I do for you historians then? Children are getting a bit bored I thought you might entertain them Oh, right young history buffs Line up, the tallest beside me and the shortest at the other end Now Roman soldiers, when Roman general addresses you You stand still, like statues Right, soldiers, Roman general says, ride your horse. <laughs> Roman general says, march. Roman general says, salute. Hail Caesar. Is that all, folks? <laughs> Brilliant as usual, Raymond. Ah, Lisa, how's my wee soldier doing? Passengers to consider. Oh, look, they're really bored and hungry. Lunch. We are going to be having our packed lunches before we do the walk, aren't we, Mickey John? Lunches? Oh no! We've got a bit of a problem, Raymond. I was so excited about the history walk that I forgot to tell the children to bring any packed lunches. So? Well, could you make the children a packed lunch to take on the walk? All of them? Oh. Oh, Mickey John, if you told me when we left Riversea Fingal, there would have been lots of time to make the lunches. But we're nearly at the terminus. Where did the time go? At eight o'clock, I dropped Lisa off at Granny Murray's house. Granny Murray was excited about going on a picnic to Castle Park to look at the statues. At nine o'clock, Mickey John was on board the train with his class. They were going to do a history walk. Mickey John told me everything about the old Roman wall. At 10 o'clock, Bobby came into the boofy car, worried about keeping the children amused on their walk. I solved the problem by suggesting that they march along the wall instead of walking. Marching's great fun. Around 11 o'clock, the children came into the boofy car, this time very noisy. So I entertained them. About 12 o'clock, Mickey John was reminded it was nearly lunchtime and he'd forgotten to ask the children to bring any packed lunches with them. It was then Mickey John asked me to make pack lunches for all of the children. Now remember, many hands make light work. Many hands make light work. Lots of hands helping. Lots of clean hands preparing things. That's it. You know what, Mickey John? This might just be possible. Let's get these soldiers back on their feet and moving. The first thing we need to do is wash our hands. It's a race against time! I've got to do it, I've got to do it I've got to beat the clock before the chime I've got to sort it, I've got to sort it I've got to do the job on time Like a busy bee, I'm going to beat that bong I'm going to finish this job before I finish this song Do we think he's going to do it? Do the job that needs to be done Will he know how to fix it? Will he finish what he has begun? Beat 
the clock before the chime I've got to sort it He's going to sort it I've got to do the job on time Like a busy bee I'm going to beat that bong I'm going to finish this job before I finish this song We're arriving at the terminus Have we got everything? Uh, walking boots? Check Guidebook? Check Children? Check Lunches? Check Right, soldiers, forward march! Right, troops, three cheers for Raymond, the best buffet attendant ever! Hip hip! Hooray! Hip hip! Hooray! Hip hip! Hooray! I wonder if Lisa knows her dad is the best buffet car attendant ever. Pretend to be statues? Oh, brilliant! <laughs> oh, here, let me take your picture and we'll show Dad when we go home. <laughs> Ready? Where are you, Daddy? Hello, Raven! Hi, Granny Murray. Look who's here, Lisa. Hi, Lisa. Have you had a good day? Oh, we've had a fast day. <laughs> and are you going to say thank you to Granny Murray? Thank you, oh, Granny can you, Murray. Darling? Oh, she's been the best girl, haven't you? And it's a big thank you to you from me too, Granny Murray. I remembered what you said. Many hands make light work. It saved the day. Well, I never did. Come on, you two. You'll want to be off home. <laughs> Looking forward to next time. Me too. Come on, Lisa. Let's chat about our time away. And I suppose you want me to tell you all about my time too. Well, there was waving, greeting, hello, meeting, bye bye, closing, wagging, dozing, eating, sleeping, fetching, sketching, painting, stretching, gluing, chewing, sticking up and wiping round, washing up and slushing down. Then there was hugging, squishing, walking, pushing, dancing, dusting, shooting, choosing. Talking, cooking, grinding, cleaning, saving, cleaning, loving, joking, losing things and rushing round, picking up and putting down. Then there was laying, running, creeping, jumping, chasing, painting, laughing, digging, bathing, dressing, singing, swinging, walking, sliding, hunting, hiding, jumping up and turning round, dressing up and sitting down. <sighs> but what was really special about today? Well. Claude was dressed as a statue because we were going to be seeing a lot of statues in the park later on. At lunchtime, the children and I packed the picnic hamper together. We packed lots of goodies, including Eccles cakes. We had a great time in the park. The children played lots of running games. Then we put a rug on the grass and had our picnic lunch. Once we had eaten, we pretended we were statues and stood really still. Oh, it was great fun. When Raymond came to collect Lisa, he said he had made lots of sandwiches with the help of many hands. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Me too. Bye-bye, honey pie.